Hi. Hi. Good morning. Hey, Scorpion. Hey, Kay. Hey, Jade, spiritual healer. What's up? Yes, I'm Steph. How you doing? Hey, Serenity. What up, brown skin beauty model? Sunflower kisses. Good morning. So, um, many of you guys know that, um, I kind of suffered a big emotional blow here recently, and I'm currently not in the space to service anyone. Um, I know that for a fact. I need to take some time and really get myself together. Um, I'm doing the best I can to heal and to hold myself accountable for certain actions. I'm doing the best I can at trying not to be so regretful or, um, you know, dwell in sadness or fear of loss or actual loss. Um, And I'm trying to try to see where I went wrong, you know. The biggest thing, um, I never want to hurt anybody I care about. And um, apparently, I did unknowingly. So I need to really soul search right now. Okay? I really have to dive deep into myself and figure some things out. And um, I have to do that alone. Okay. So as public as I typically am and as jovial and jubilee as I typically am at this time, I need to have reverence for the connection that was lost. Um, I need to, it would be so disrespectful to just bounce back as if this hasn't affected me because it has. This was harder this is harder than breaking up with someone. And um, I need time. So I just sent out an email. I'll read it to you guys right now. And um, it's going to lead into the updates that I'm going to give you. Um, I'm going to give myself three days. Three. Father, Son, Holy Ghost. Heaven, Earth, Hell. You know, three is a a pivotal number in my belief system. Um And as you can see, when an emotional blow happens to me, I try to perform through it. But certain blows, bro, you you can't perform like you. You got to you got to go inside yourself. So that's what I'm doing right now. Um, And I got to do it alone. I want to thank my squad. You guys are perfect. You're perfect. The way you keep me lifted, the way you, you know, come to my aid, even though you're just as shocked as me. Like, I just fucking love you guys. Um, I love my audience. I love my fan base. I love my clients. I love all of you very, very much. But at this time, I just need time. I can't perform. I can't read right now. I just need to. Cry and let this sink in and figure out how I can plot a different course. This is what the email says. Hey, guys, I am actively going to the stages of grief after a huge emotional blow on the night of the full moon. I recognize that I need space and a bit of freedom to heal and get myself together before servicing anyone. I pride myself on my accuracy and durability, but this hurt bad and I truly don't didn't see this one coming. I'm attempting to bounce back as best I can, but I cannot stop crying this morning. Please check your email for rescheduled appointment times. And all remaining tip dry readings will be answered by next week. Due to this inconvenience, Colt Wow will continue to be active and even work for appointments until Monday. Thank you for all of the kind words and messages that I have received, especially from my squad. I will bounce back. 
but must put my healing first before pouring from my cup right now. Thank you for understanding, and I will see you guys soon, Love Boots. Very short email, very lax pizzazz. Um, <clears throat> but it's real. And when 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 things like this happen to me, I'm also matched with the fact that I feel like I'm letting you guys down. So I don't want you to feel like, damn, you know, my needs aren't met by boots. Um, I never want you to feel like that. I don't want you to feel like I don't care about your concerns because 10,000 clients later and 76 celebrities, I'm always available. But right now I need, I need someone. <laughs> and the person that I would typically go to is the person who caused the problem. So I just, uh, I don't have it in me right now. And I want, I want to, I want to have it in me right now. I want to work. But I am so just, I'm so broken by that. Uh, um, so for the next couple of days, I won't be live. I'll just be in my bubble trying to figure, figure myself out. Um, and it's taken a lot of strength to even come talk to you guys right now. I just really want to hide and I'm combating, you know, suicidal thoughts. Um, but I've, I've been there before. I've got counseling for that. I know what to do. Uh, I'm, I, that, that broke, that broke me. Um, so I just wanted to say, uh, sorry that I can't show up. Um, and, uh, I hope you guys understand. Um, if you want refunds or whatever, I mean, I'm down. I, but, um, <clears throat> that one hurt. I pride myself on my transparency and being real with you guys. Um, and I thank you guys for uh, for accepting me and listening. But I need a minute. Ugh. I need a hot minute, bitch. <laughs> Um, so the plan, <laughs> let's get, let's get to the plan. The plan is to take today off, tomorrow off, Sunday. I do have two clients. Um, and I'm, that's going to be my practice. Like, bitch, can you do this <laughs> on Sunday? Um, and they're very, they're, they're close clients, so it shouldn't be a problem. And then the 23rd, 24th and 25th, I'm full time with the bullshit. Um, I'll get off on Thursday the 26th and the 27th I'm working full a full day and then on the 30th I'm working a full day I'm sorry I'm just looking at my schedule so like I I have to choreograph this around my healing and I, I don't <sighs> typically somebody else does this for me um Yeah, on on Monday the twenty third, or even on Sunday after my clients, I'll probably dust that tip jar. It's okay, sir. I'm going through it too, hush. Yeah. So I just wanted to, you know, give you the business update while navigating my emotions and being empowered by. People who've been in similar positions, I want to give a special shout out to T.S. Madison and a special shout out to Ari Lennox. Um, you guys are fucking awesome. <clears throat> mm. Um. Yeah. 
so that's 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 where I'm at. And you know, my 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 job is highly based on how I feel, and I know that I'm resilient. I'm stronger than most. But check on your strong friends, bro. Check on your strong friends because everything ain't always good. You know what I'm saying? But it will be because I'll make it good. I just need to do what that last spell said. Recharge. And now I'm thinking about it. Maybe this is all a part of recharging. That's a powerful piece of work. Like, I casted that spell on Sunday. All hell broke loose three days after. Which brought me down to, like, ground zero. And I feel like as time goes on, it's just like I'm... Got to grieve first. And then you go, you come back stronger. You always have done that. No matter what loss it is. Like, you always bounce back. You always bounce back. I just... This one... If I when I bounce back from this, ain't nothing gonna hurt me, bro. I promise you, ain't nothing gonna hurt me. Ain't nothing gonna break me down. I promise. And maybe y'all need to see that. Like, there's a reason why I'm transparent about this journey. Like, maybe y'all need to see that being broke into the core and bouncing back. I don't know, but I do know I trust God regardless. Faith stronger than most. <clears throat> I trust God. Whatever you doing, whatever you doing, I'm with it. But I hear you when you say I need a break. I need to just breathe. I need to need to need to go within myself. Uh, if you don't know what happened, it'll never be repeated. Um, it's okay. If you don't know what happened, it'll never be repeated on live. It'll never be talked about. Um, it's um, too painful. Way too painful. So I'll end this video by doing what we always do. We're going to pray. And we're going to ask God to intercede on our behalf God of the universe God of love God of light I come to you as humbly as I know how broken I service a lot of people and now I need the service of you why why did this happen can you tell me can you make it clear I actually don't even want to know I just want to be full again I I'm hurt by this it maybe is a part of the protection that I have or maybe it's just me maybe I just have to accept accountability for the way I've made people feel or God I have no words I just I didn't see this one come in And I need you. And I need you right now. Please. Please intercede on my behalf. God, you've given me so many people that love me, that service me. And I just need you to strengthen me for them. I need... I need the comfort of God. I need strength and resilience at this time. I need... I need rest. I need... I need presence. And I really need... I need to know what I did wrong. I have ultimate faith in you. I know... We've been through a lot together, God. A lot worse than this.
Amen. I'll see you guys soon. I love you guys. Um, and have a, a good rest of your day. Peace.